Well guys, it is day six of the 30 day challenge. Or, I should say, we're back to day one. We failed. So yesterday we put the uh, disc golf net indoors because it was like a uh, hundred out. Alexa, what's the weather today? In McChesney Park, it's 64 degrees Fahrenheit with cloudy skies. Alexa, stop. Today's forecast... Yeah, it's, um... <laughs> it was 100 yesterday and it's like 65 today. Um, what? What is going on? So, yeah, um, there's a lot of things that I've been putting off doing outdoors because of how hot it's been. And I'm, you know, really not trying to clean when it's like 100. Like, I need to clean the garage. I need to clean the cube out here. I need to do a bunch of vacuuming. A bunch of tedious, grown-up, you know, adulting things. Being responsible. Um, and I just, you know, didn't want to do it when it was like 100 out. So I've been putting it off. Well, I guess today's the day. We can't put it off anymore. Um... As I stated at the beginning of this video, we failed, uh, we relapsed, we used again, so um, yeah, we're back to day one, today's day one, it won't be to the end of this month anymore, it'll be after the end of this month, you get what I'm saying, right? We're gonna go for the next 30 days until we can be clean, so um, yeah, let's start today's video with getting our run out the way, um, it's day one for running, so I don't really have a goal, it's just go out and run, you can run pretty slow. Um, probably going to be more of just a jog today because honestly my head still kind of hurts and I just um yeah I don't know kind of mad at myself kind of just not in the mood to really run that fast I am glad that it's nice and cool out um yeah I don't know what today's plan is probably gonna pick up this cube here because I'm kind of getting tired of it being dirty yesterday we kind of cleaned this whole section today I think we're gonna clean this whole section maybe even clean up all of this take all these rocks outside I got like a bunch more rocks and stuff over here if you can't tell I've um I've been neglecting cleaning for the past months so I think we're gonna try and maybe pick up this stuff today maybe try and clean up this area um yeah, I don't know. Today and the next few vlogs, probably going to be a lot of cleaning. But hopefully it stays nice and cool like this so we can um, get all the outdoor stuff done. I got like a ring video camera that I still need to hook up in my backyard with like a solar panel and stuff. And I just kind of been putting it off because, well, it's something that I've never done. I don't know what I'm doing or if I'm doing it right or... I don't know, kind of going in blind there. All right, we're ran in Ravens. See, this is what happens when I um, sober me. My brain just goes from thing to thing to thing to thing to thing, and I just need to, like, do one thing, and then do the next thing, and then do the next thing, and get things done before we move on, but I just get very preoccupied and... Ooh, Frisbees! Ooh, knives! Oh, hi, Lola, how you doing? You know, it's just from one thing to the next. It's, it's hard to stay focused, if you can't tell. But, all right. I'm putting my shoes on. We're going to get our run, jog, whatever for day one out the way. And then we can uh, come back and start cleaning. What are you getting excited for? Huh? What are you getting excited for? Someone's got too much energy. You want to go for a run? You want to go for a run? Yeah? You want to go with? I think I'm going to take a little with on my run because, um, one, I don't plan on running very fast. As I said earlier, it's kind of more just a jog today back on day one. I really don't want to run at all. Like very much so been delaying for the past hour but i don't want to run at the end of the night i did that last night it didn't work out um i definitely am a morning runner so we're gonna take lola with we're not worried about her time just gotta uh get it done you ready all right guys we just finished our run back at day one starting back over when you mess up it's not about the fact that you mess up it's how you react to it. When you get knocked down, you gotta get back up. So, me and Lola, we went on our run. Honestly, it was a really good run. I wore the uh, normal shoes again, as opposed to the uh, barefoot shoes, which I know I said I wanted to get in shape with the barefoot shoes. But um, these things just, uh, they're like gloves on the bottom of my feet. I just feel like I'm running on sponges. So comfortable. And um, yeah, I don't know, that was a good run. I'm really kind of looking forward to tomorrow um being that my calves aren't sore i shouldn't be tired we should be energized ready to go and when i first started this 
I thought I was going to try and um, increase my mile time. Like that was kind of the goal. Is, you know, every day, let's see how fast we can get a mile in. But after just running that run, part of me wants to try and go for distance. Really a part of me wants to run a marathon. It's one of those things that's like hard to do, but it's totally doable. Stop. I'm trying to make a video here. You can't be doing that. So, um, yeah, part of me wants to run a marathon. It's totally doable. I know I can do it. It's just taking the time to train for it. Um, you know, if I start, like, today I ran a mile. Tomorrow we run, like, a mile and a quarter. The next day we run a mile and a half. Next day we run a mile and three-fourths. Next day we run two miles. And we just keep going. Like, eventually we'll be at a marathon. But every day I add an extra 400 meters... I'm also adding an extra 10 minutes, 15 minutes. And when it gets down, you know, up into the 20 miles, that's going to be taking a few hours to uh, to train, to do. Where running this mile right now only takes me 10 minutes, you know, 8 minutes, 7 and a half minutes if I really run fast. So 7 and a half minutes to me, that's nothing, you know, that's no time. But a few hours of time, that's kind of the one big thing that's keeping me from doing it in the back of my head i definitely want to do it and eventually someday i think i'm definitely gonna do it i just don't know if we're gonna do it now i don't know guys let me know would you guys want to see me try and prepare and train and go run a marathon i think it'd be kind of cool to uh go run the chicago marathon someday but um, yeah, let me know in those comments down below if that'd be something you guys would be interested in or if I should just do it on my own time and not bore you guys all with me just running. I don't know. Let me know. What do you guys think? Well, it's kind of spitting and I wanted to go play some frisbee golf, but now that it's spitting, I don't know that I'm gonna. Will just came over. Not sure what we're doing. <laughs> she asked if she could help me clean. I have a bunch of rocks that I need to go put out in the garage. What? That's the shed. I want to see what's in there. It's the key's inside. I'd have to go all the way inside, grab the key, and then come back out. Well, um, why do you have a dog bed in there and a lot of work stuff? Because you like making stuff? Yeah, it's a shop. How do you, wait, you want to see what's in there? How do you know there's a dog bed in there if you've never seen in there? Well, I see, I'm seeing, can I see in there? I saw in there before. Do you want to see in there again? Like well, right now? Like in there, it's more cooler. It's it's, it's worse than it to that be outside when it's raining. It's warm or cooler. I mean, we can go in there, I guess. I just had to go grab the key. It's back inside. Where is it? Inside. Where inside? Hanging up on the key box. <gasps> Sammy! Do you like Sammy? Yeah. I need to clear out these bushes so I can see him. <laughs> well, I would like to do it. Hey, buddy. Organize the house. You want to organize the house or you want to go in the shop? Uh, I think you should clean your shop someday too. The shop's pretty clean. Well, All right, let, here, let's go grab the key because I want to go see something. Then we will come back for Sammy. I mean, I guess if you want to go see him. Can you do a handstand cartwheel? Can I? Can yeah. You, like, so, when you're in the and that's your cartwheel. this is where all my rocks are. I need to take all those rocks inside and basically add them over here. I need to even clean have all this these leaves out too. This is for like art. So why? Um, this was in the garbage. Someone threw it away, and I saved it because I was like, "Hey, that's not garbage." And now it's here. This is a What's saw it? that someone also threw in the garbage. And I saved it because it's a craftsman table saw. Like, why would you throw this away? It works. I already tried it. It even has a stand over here. Um, what about all of this junk? That's what I'm talking about. You have a cone. You have old bricks. I know. It's a mess, huh? Why do you have bricks? Well, it's not bricks. They're two by fours. Then why do you have cones? Um, I honestly don't know why I have that cone, but it's what I use when I back up the car. I look at the cone in the rear view mirror and then 
That's how I know where to go. But we need to clean it all out. We need to... Hey, come here. Let me know if you what ever you get? want to clean this hey, stop. house. I'm probably, like, I'm probably going to stay here too. My parents are done, like, emptying out the house. Oh, they're emptying all Mimi or your mom? Yeah, because um, the the fleas they need to get it all out the all stuff the house and wash it. So that's you anything work. good? And uh, my mom. Comed bills. What is this gaff? I don't even know what this is. Your gaff warranty. Who oh. wants to? Uh, do you think you should bunch of junk clean mail. my houses? Take all of these rocks out put them in the driveway grab a broom sweep up all these leaves get all the leaves out of here and then we can put them back and then once the area is clean we'll take all the rocks from inside and we'll bring them out here so, yeah that sounds like a good idea yeah so what do we start with first i think we start with first moving the car into the driveway so it's out of our way okay i have to be over there because well i can just go in the car yeah, you can go in the car. I gotta go grab the key though. Key's Only inside. Only time I go in the front. Did you get your eyeball? My eyeball? Picture? No. Oh, I can go get it in a couple Something. And all right. Where did you keep on every week? We're making progress. We got all the rocks out. About to move this shelf out, all this stuff from the corner. And I can sweep, get all these leaves out of here. Move everything from this side over to this side. Do it on this side. And then once that's all done, then we can get everything from inside, all those rocks, hopefully over here, get everything all organized. Can you just ride by? I'd say it looks pretty good. Got two piles of dirt. This is all cleaned out. Now we can get this stuff out here, all back in. Oh, get all get all our rocks back in here, and we can get all the rocks from inside over here organized, and then get everything back over there. Cleaning the garage. Clean, but Willow just informed me I need to get my bike. <laughs> Apparently, we're riding bikes and scooters now, so. I guess the cleaning will have to wait a few minutes. What bushes? Those bushes. Why? You don't like that you can't see? Uh, well, you can't see Sammy back there. I know, you can't see anything. It's privacy. <laughs> Alright, we are out on the bike. Because Willow said we can clean later, so... Yeah. <laughs> I guess it's one of the uh, positives to not having a job. Yeah, we're YouTubing. Of course. You always make videos. Yeah, of course. You make a video every day. What, you don't like my videos? Uh, you make too many, I don't. No, I don't. You think I make too many videos? Oh, you put them on YouTube? Yeah. What is your channel called? Beardo the Weirdo. What? Beardo the Weirdo. Okay. And he put one of my videos on there. Yeah, I put your video from yesterday. Uh, not yesterday. Two days ago. Hold on. Okay, I'm gonna run fast. I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing that my first viewers are six and eight year olds, but <laughs> I guess you gotta start somewhere, guys.
I was really curious if Mr. Officer there was going to say anything about the fact that I'm just riding my bike down the road. But, yeah, he didn't care. So, that's cool. Okay. Not that I'm doing anything wrong, but, you know, these days. Alright, now where are we going? Just going over here. <laughs> I thought we were going to the garage. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, there. my parents know you guys. There's way too much stuff in that garage. Alright, back to my house. Hopefully you can go finish cleaning. What? I got the kids following me. He has more of the stuff than who I know. Cody's <laughs> um, Oh, what is this video? Also, side note, um, because of so last night's relapse, board? I am starving right now. And I cannot wait to go home and eat that chicken. My appetite, oh man. I could like eat a whole pizza. Oh, here comes the rain again. I felt the raindrop. Yep. Might get wet. Okay. What? Wait, wait. You know, that's not and the one I'm talking about. These, these, that goes right there. So it even tells you what it is. So I know that's an amethyst. It's pretty cool. Yeah, Unique and little shape. This is copper. Oh, they all got little cards. Yeah. Cool. And this is a specimen. It's a king crown. See what that is? Okay. Let's see what is it? It's a king crown. This one says it's. This one is a fossil. Oh, that's cool. Hmm. What is the green one? This. This one. Um. It says it's a mineral. Advent, adventuring, adventuring. Adv hmm, that's cool. Yes, I that like that one. green color. This one's a little bit broken. Yeah, but still looks nice. This one's probably from the, uh, like Jade. a baby like unicorns thing. I forgot what they're called. I got this. It's a broken though. This other piece. Um, what's this? Love that green. Look at this one. Oh wow, it's like rainbow. It's a mint. Peacock ore. That's cool. Here. Yeah, let me take this out into the sun. Oh, look at the colors on that. It's like a rainbow rock. Yeah. Did you paint it or did you find it like no, that? No, it's I natural. I found it like that. Yeah. Made by the earth over millions of years. That's stinking cool. Yeah, that's one of my favorite ones that's, that's in there. Yeah, that, I really like that one. Me too. I got like this weird thing. Oh, that's a cool shell. Oh, I have one of those, but not like that. What's this? This one's kind it's of a like specimen a snake head. Oh, my bag's blown away. Can you go grab that, Will? This is a specimen snake head. You can just... You can just throw it away. It just goes in the garbage. What does that say? Earth. Earth something. That's what this... It's a mini arrow. Oh, it's like a little mini arrowhead. Oh. Cody, look at this one. That's cool. Oh, wow. Where, where, where'd that one come from? Okay. So that one's your favorite, Kristen? One of my favorites, yeah. Oh, this one's my favorite. Oh, that's a cool cluster. Oh, that one's my favorite and this one. This quartz? One. Yeah. <laughs> These are all my favorite. Like, some of them don't have the right things in them because it's really old. That looks kind of like sea glass. Whoa, it's I have like tons clear. Of sea glass. I know. Clear and polished. Do you have any sea glass? I don't know. I like that green Op one, too. Optical. Look at the lines on that. What does that say? Optical castle? Uh, calcite, I think, is what it is. That's what this is. Hold on, is it the same thing as this? What's this? Uh, they're very close, I think. Why doesn't this one it's have a crystal name? crystal something. Grayson, she's talking to you. What? Why doesn't this one have a name? I, um, uh, it's a shell. It's a it type looks of like shell. the horn for a unicorn. I mean... 
since these are very old, some of them over the years. Wow, the, you'd think this would be heavy, but it's like super light. These things have been mis got missing. This is like the world rock. But the world rock. <laughs> but some of them that don't have the thing in it. No, that one was right there, right? Yeah. So, but some of them that don't have any, any like this one's mineral, and it's that. Okay. So what's this one? Why is it just behind that one? It feels like, it looks like there's dust on that one. Yeah, it looks like dust, but it's not. So, fossil. So, this is a fossil. I would love to find one of these just out in the wild. I so would cool. love to find all of these for my collection. I found one like this before. This is a fossil. She's coming over and she's got something pretty cool. Oh, you got it done? Yeah. Oh, look at that. That's cool. I love those. Do oh, more. thank you. Now I gotta find a spot to hang it up in my house. I know where to put it. You know where to put it? Yeah, well, it looks like a really nice spot. Where? I love Jim Art. I have I have, yeah, I have the big ones though. You can it's come really in if you fun. want. Like the gem art what I have are those like um this size and also oh, like better. Well I broke that so Where are you putting it? Where where would you think it should go? I wanted it to be right here or right here and it's cleaned off. Well maybe we'll put it like up here or something? Well it's already in the frame. Hmm. Alright, we'll find a spot for hey, it. Put all right, so we got all the rocks from inside, outside. We got this entire corner nice and clean. Let's go open the shed and see if we can get the table saw with the stand and see if we can get to fit in the shop. It's definitely gonna be tight, but um, we should clean the shop. I'm tired of it being out in the garage. You're right, we should clean the shop. Well, it ain't much, but it's a 10 by 10 shed. That's what we call the shop. We got a nice workbench, 2 by 72 an anvil that I'm not even sure if it's steel. Obviously, Harbor Freight anvil, drill press, I have that other drill press. And um, as you can see, there's pretty much, as soon as there's two people, it's crowded. So, kind of a one-man shop. I'm hoping I can put the table saw just in this corner on the stand. But if that don't work, then they're both just going to go under here and then we'll have to like assemble it when we need it. Not really sure, but for now, I think we're just going to stick it over in this corner, get it out of the garage. And, oh man, we got to take all this garbage out too. All that garbage we can throw away now that we actually have the garbage. You getting spider webs on you? There's a bunch of spiders in here, see. They're not paying me rent. What makes them think they can cover my forge in spider webs? Here's a knife we were working on at one point. Never finished. Beefy boy. I wish I could remember, uh, like, what piece of metal this was from. I have no idea. Maybe this was a lawnmower blade? No. Is it sharp? No, not right now. Not so, even right here? No, there's no edge on it. It's not convex to an edge yet. Alright, let's uh, move this out of the way and then we'll go grab the saw and hopefully get it in here. I just don't want to break it because I don't have it. Then you won't be able to get your kayak down? Yeah, that's what I use it for, honestly. My kayak stick. Well, you can use the broom to get them down. I can. Or you could just not break my stick that I use. <laughs> Alright, so table fit. I am super happy with how much we got cleaned out of the garage. Let me go show you. So, I got this garbage can. Which you guys saw all the garbage in the corner of the shop there. This garbage can was sitting in here under the table saw. Look how clean this is now. Oh my gosh, it's so much better. Obviously, I still got a ton of dirt here. I need to get uh, one of my dad's push brooms or one of his like leaf blowers. And then I can just blow it all out. It'd be so much easier. Um, but I'm not putting a garbage can back in here. There's no reason to. This garbage can can now go in the shop. And then once I clear out all that garbage, I'll have a garbage can in the shop. 
Oh man, this is getting so nice. I'm so happy with how this is turning out. Go grab the uh, table saw now. Go Cody. stick it in there on the stand. Hopefully it fits. Hey Cody. Now that I'm looking at it, this is going to be a little bit wider. I'm going to grab a tape measure and measure it first. Hey Cody. What? After you're done putting that in, can we play statues? I mean, we can play if you want, I guess. I don't know. Grab my tape measure. Come on. And this you need... Well, this... You know, I don't appreciate you barking right in my ear. I also don't appreciate when I forget to hit record. Because I definitely just measured this and I thought I was recording. Apparently, I wasn't. Have you been just sitting under there the whole time? gonna have to do some rearranging and figure out what we're doing here I think this which is currently secured to the floor I think it needs to be unsecured from the floor I kind of like this being on the wheels and being able to move it around it seems to uh, be sturdy enough I'm not sure um, yeah this is another problem for another day it's in here it's out of my garage that was my main goal and honestly I'm pretty happy with it. The garage has so much more room now. You guys got a small shop tour. I have no idea what else we're doing today, if we're doing anything else today. Oh, just been cleaning. Bunch of cleaning and organizing. Doing a bunch of stuff that I've been putting off for way too long. And man, it feels good to get it done. All right, on to the next thing. All right, we're just in a cleaning mood. So let's just uh, keep at it. I am cleaning right now. I'm about to clean out this whole cube. All these recyclables. So I got this entire side cleaned out. And then everything that was over here, I just moved over here. Clean out this whole side. And then the uh, cleaning, I think, for the day will be done. I've cleaned and organized enough stuff that I've been putting off for way too long. It's finally clean. Let's go. <clears throat> I put off cleaning this for way too long. And I think I'm probably going to leave the shoe rack over there. I kind of didn't like it there anyways. So I definitely like it better in this corner. You can find another spot for a recycling bin. Sweet. Tomorrow, maybe we'll clean the kitchen. <laughs> you got your tongue out, your eyes open, and you're snoring? What? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to wake you. Guys, I don't remember where today's video left off. But today's video is done. It's currently midnight. I just spent the last like three hours editing. We got today's video all done and uploaded in just under two minutes. With two minutes to spare. I don't know how to say that. I, I'm tired. Um, I'm going to try and hopefully get four or five hours of sleep. And then wake up and do our morning run. But uh. Oh, yeah. That's pretty much it for today's video. Hopefully it wasn't too much of a long one. I kind of have a hard time gauging how long they're going to be or how long I need to make them or when I need to shut up or when I need to keep talking. I don't know. Do you guys want it short, sweet, to the point, or do you like me ranting and raving? Let me know in those comments down below. Let me know what your mild times are. We'll be back at it again tomorrow. I know we failed today. Tomorrow we start back at day one. It's okay, guys. If you get knocked down, you just got to get back up. Make sure you guys subscribe if you haven't already. It's free. All you got to do is uh, hit that button up there. And then make sure you click that bell so you get notified when we go live. Or when we post, when we go live, all of our future f updates. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Make sure you guys like, favorite, share, do what you got to do. Don't forget, subscribe if you haven't already. As always, guys, I'll see you tomorrow.